warning signs remain up at Puena Point Beach Park on Oahu's North Shore after officials say a shark bit a surfer on the leg. Chris Latronic joins us now live in Haleiwa with more. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Sam and Christine. Yes, I'm here right out front pool in a beach park, Point Beach Park, and you can see the signs are still up. But it hasn't deterred the surfers. We actually just saw three surfers, even one earlier, just going out by himself. And you might be able to see him in the distance. I did ask him if uh, he knew about the shark attack. He did, but I think he was more concerned about getting the empty lineup. And uh, that was also uh, the concern yesterday after the shark attack of a 30-year-old 30, uh, 30 uh, male that was uh, on a, actually a honeymoon uh, with his, his uh, now wife from Europe. And that's when he got attacked. There was reports from other witnesses that when it happened, they were out there. There was a bigger set that broke. And then after everyone was off their boards uh, recovering, that's when the attack happened. But also within the past four days, there was reports from surf instructors and, uh, and other people uh, uh, frequenting the beach that there was a juvenile tiger shark roaming the lineup here and there. So they're also expecting that that could have been the culprit of the attack. Uh, so you just want to be safe. It is their land. We also saw uh, the two other surfers that just went by me were kind of like, oh, they didn't even know about the shark attack, but that didn't deter them to go out. They're like, oh, well, that's their land is what she told me. And now they're going to go out and have some fun. But it is October. And during this time, scientists have said that lots of female tiger sharks come down the island chain from the northwestern Hawaiian Islands to come breed and feed and even give birth to their young here in the island. So you just want to be safe as they are extra active and they do call it Sharktober. Um, and also after the attack happened, there was even some surf that still went out. And this was their reaction. Totally empty. <laughs> yeah, when I went out, there was one uh, guy on a foil out there. That was literally it. So I was like, wow, this is, yeah, rare sight to see with actual swell. <laughs> Keeping a little extra eye out, there was really good clarity right now. So it was pretty easy to see everything below and just kind of staying on the board a little more maybe. <laughs> Yeah, so you want to stay safe out there. Uh, October is definitely more active month for sharks and also surfers, as we didn't have much of a sep uh, September here on the North Shore, so more people are hungry. There goes that surfer all by himself, getting the getting all waves to himself uh, here at the lineup at Puuena Beach Park. So it's up to you. Be extra safe out there. I suggest if you are still a beginner, go to other beaches that are heavily guarded by lifeguards or uh, just uh, check in, be safe with the locals here or just stay out the water all together. This is Chris Atronic working for Hawaii reporting live from Pua and Point Beach Park, checking out the surf, staying safe from sharks and sending things back to you. Mahalo Chris, appreciate the tips and the info.